And he is. Green flag is that, folks. Let's go racing on a Saturday night. Cody Ashcraft taking the lead early on. Looks like he was getting a little loose coming out of turn number two there, but it seems he's got it under control there. As Ashcraft slides out of three into four, now to the front straightaway, continues to be your leader. Seven to go. Derek Morrow now giving chase in the 16 car. Derek Morrow's been knocking on the door of success all season long. Will tonight be the night where he finally uh, breaks that glass ceiling and finds himself in victory lane? The 57T car goes up on the berm there, folks. We're going to get a, uh, looks like we're going to get that yellow flag here momentarily. We're going to have another car go off the track. All right, a green flag is out, seven to go. Lost a couple cars out there due to uh, a mishap earlier. But we'll see if this does Derek Morrow any favors, see if he can close the gap on Cody Ashcraft as they take out a turn number two into the back straightaway. Ashcraft continues to be your leader, but Morrow now trying to peek on the inside there as they go into turn number three. Let's see if Morrow's got it on the inside here. Looks like he does have it. Morrow now your leader. Morrow now getting in front of Ashcraft as Casey Murdoch in the 505 car. Make a play here, folks, so we're going to see what happens here now. Ashcraft trying to go inside, coming out of turn four. But Morrow is able to hold him off. Murdoch giving chase in third as a 13 car. Alan Hakes currently running fourth. Coming around to the halfway point, Derek Morrow continues to be your leader, followed by Cody Ashcraft. Casey Murdoch currently running third. Alan Hakes fourth. Julia Alves currently running fifth. We'll see if uh, Cody can bring anything for Derek coming in. Oh, we got Murdoch going around and around. Hakes able to avoid him. Alves gets around. But Murdoch able to stay underneath his own power coming out of turn number four, so we'll stay underneath the green flag conditions here. Murdoch's car a little slow trying to get up to speed there. Maybe having some technical difficulties there as Morrow leads another lap followed by Ashcraft. Alan Hakes now currently running third. Julie Abba is running fourth. Murdoch having a little bit more problems over there on the back straightaway there as he looked like he was going off the side over there. See if he can't get it under control here. Morrow has the white flag. Just a couple more turns of the steering wheel. He's going to find himself a heat race victor here in our opening contest at Central Arizona Speedway. Morrow now drifting out of three into four. Ashcraft looking to make a little bit of a push there towards the end, but Derek Morrow able to hang on to it as Derek Morrow claims the heat race victory, followed by Cody Ashcraft in second, Alan Hakes in third. Looks like Julia Alves will round out the pack in fourth. The revenant up, green flag is out. This one's scheduled for eight laps. Pure stock heat race number two underway as Nelson Morrow quickly looks to the outside to find a lane to try to take the lead here. Now Jack Lacey gets underneath. Lacey zooms to the front of the pack on the back straightaway here. Lacey gets turned way around. All the other cars trying to avoid him. Good job by the other drivers. No contact made. We'll see if we can't stay under green flag conditions. These cars are rolling underneath their own power, so it doesn't look like we're gonna get the yellow flag, thank goodness. As John Drake continues to be your leader, it's got to wonder if the sun in their eyes had anything to do with those guys peeling out like that over there. Drake trying to hold on to it, trying to keep Morrow at bay. Morrow goes underneath on the back straightaway as Steve Schumacher now entering the fray, going into turn number three and four. Whoa, Dingus gets a little loose coming out of turn four as well. Schumacher overtakes his second spot. 
John Drake continues to be your leader. Now Schumacher making the move underneath, coming out of turn number two to the back straightaway. Schumacher now in front of Drake. As we are coming to the halfway point, all the action seems to be happening between three and four there, folks. Schumacher, now your leader. Could this be the night for Steve Schumacher? So far, he's looking pretty good out there in this heat race, folks. John Drake giving up a heck of a challenge as well this evening. Two to go, next lap. Schumacher continues to be your leader. Drake in second, Morrow Jr. in third. Donald Stomp Comstock rounding out in the fourth spot. Schumacher and Comstock, among others, and trying to get to victory lane, get that checkered flag this year. As Morrow now trying to make his way around Drake, unable to do it. Schumacher continues to be your leader. We'll see what happens with these lead cars as it looks like they're going to get into some of the slower traffic. One of the cars just went off to the, to the pit area now. So the Pure Stocks, the story here is looking like they're trying to figure it out before their main event as Steve Schumacher captures the white flag. A couple more turns in the steering wheel. He's going to find himself in the heat race victory lane aspect of this one. Schumacher now having to get by some slower traffic. We'll see if that impends any progress he tries to have over there. Schumacher comes out of turn number four. The checkered flag awaits for Steve Schumacher. He's your winner. John Drake finishes second. Nelson Morrow third. And Donald Comstock finishes out in fourth. Michael Reitzman, Jack Lacey, Chandler Dodge, and Andy Wheat round out the pack.